Hi there. Welcome back to Sweet Keto. Um, today we're going to do some egg bites. So we're going to do like an imitation on Starbucks egg bites. I love eating those, but if you do not know, those are sometimes higher on carbs than what you want. So I'm going to show you an easy way how to do that. So first of all, we're going to need our eggs, which we have right here. And I had left over some spinach artichoke with shrimp. Yes, we're gonna put shrimp in our eggs. We want all the protein we could get. So we're gonna mix all that and I'm gonna use a little bit of heavy cream. So if you wanna see the recipe, stay tuned. So I don't know about you guys, but it's really cold outside. It's been hi. raining. Hi. hi. Say hi everyone. Hi. Say bye to my, see my mom's channel. See my mom's channel. She's so funny. She always wants to come out. So, um, I have my oven heating up. Um, I put it at 350 and we're gonna cook these for 25 minutes, just until your egg is cooked all the way. Um, so we're gonna use about five eggs and maybe six, depending. Because I already have this mixed. So I want to see exactly how much. So I'm going to get my heavy cream out of my fridge and um, my whisk. And we'll show you just in a bit how you do this. So in our mixing bowl, we're going to crack a few eggs. And you want to use a muffin tin. You could grease the muffin tin, but I personally... Um, don't like greasing it. I'll just line them with some cupcake lighters and it's so much easier to do that. So we're going to do our eggs. We're going to crack five eggs. And this is a great breakfast or even like snack or lunch you don't want to like having to like be like if you're in a hurry and you want to eat in your car this is like the greatest recipe to do that for just because sometimes you're on the go all the time so in my in my situation it's always like that so i like to be prepared so we're gonna whisk this i have five eggs i think i'm gonna add six and like I said, I love going to Starbucks. Yes, I do. I'm a coffee lover. And um, when it comes to Starbucks, like they get me with the egg bites. So if I could make it at home and make my homemade coffee at home, like there's no need to spend $10 on just yourself for that. When I could buy something from Amazon for that much. So we're gonna just whisk it. And we're going to add about a half a cup of your heavy cream. And this just makes it more velvety. Um, like the feel from Starbucks. If you've never added heavy cream to your eggs, where have you been all this time? It's like the greatest thing ever. So now we're gonna just put a little bit of salt. And I am gonna put some pepper. Let's crush our peppers, corn. You wanna season everything. I know this is already seasoned because that's what we stuffed our mushrooms with, but you wanna make sure it goes through the whole entire dish. So each egg bite of these, it's about a carb and a half. So literally like, you're not even like, it's a perfect, like you have three in be full and not even have like that much. Oh my God, this smells delicious. 
So the spinach, everything is going to be just amazing. And then we're just going to mix this and we're going to put it in, in our cupcake liners. So whenever we have like stuff like this left over, like or chorizo or your, um, anything like really like um, sausage, you can always make egg bites with it. So don't throw it away. Even like bacon, like, you know, it's a great way to save some money and just make this delicious. So now I have like a measuring cup because I do not like making a mess, which I feel like I'm gonna do right now. Come on now. Let's get in there. Okay, whatever. <laughs> it's fighting with me. So now we're just gonna line our cupcake liners. with our mixture. Now you could go as high as you want. I just do enough for it to like be like this. And I'm gonna keep going. And like I said, this is a perfect breakfast, even lunch or snack when you're on the go. So, I love spinach. I love artichokes. I have never had artichokes like I told you guys before because um, I am Mexican, but like I love them. They're so delicious. I know a lot of us is like, oh, what is that? <gasps> Sorry, guys. My kids and yeah. their Roblox addiction. So I'm just gonna see how pretty those are. amazing okay so now that we have all of our pans we still have a little bit mixture left you just could go in and fill it in whichever ones you feel that may need a little bit more i don't know about you guys but my kids are like obsessed with roblox i don't even know what that is I tell them, in my days, we used to go to the liquor store and play those little machines, like little Pac-Man or Mortal Kombat, whatever. So, anyways, that's a little bit over that. So, I'm going to put this in the oven for 25 minutes, and I'll show you guys how it looks. So, getting ready to work out while my thing is kicking. Like I said, I put it in at 350 for... 25 minutes. I'm going to check on it right now and see how it looks. Um, so we don't over bake them. Oh my God. The smell on this is delicious. So I'm going to work out really quick while this is cooking and I'll show you guys how it looks right at the end. Okay guys, so really quick. I did overfill them just a tiny bit, but look at these egg bites. Oh my God. The smell on them is amazing. Like you are going to be so happy when you guys have these. Um, there's still a little bit of more time on them, but 
I did give them an extra 10 minutes. So just wanted to tell you. Here that. it is guys. They just came out of the oven. Like when I attempt to not burn myself. How can we do this without burning ourselves? There we go. What? Did you guys see this? Look at the fluffiness on this beautiful egg bite. Okay guys, so thank you so much for watching. If you like what you see, please subscribe to my channel, give it a thumbs up and leave a comment. Here are our egg bites. We're gonna let them chill. Gonna give it a little taste for you guys. Amazing. You are not gonna regret it for not wasting your leftover stuffing on your mushrooms. Amazing flavor. Give it a thumbs up. Thank you.